The next type of bond we're going to talk about is the covalent bond. Now we got to see in the last video that ionic bonds are formed between cations and anions. Now they are metals lose electrons to become cations. Non-metals accept the electrons to become anions. Now for covalent bonds, they are formed between two non-metals. So non-metals form covalent bonds. What do they do? They share electrons. In ionic bonds, the electrons are given out or taken in. When they share electrons, a force of attraction is formed between them. When they share electrons, the force of a force of attraction is formed between them. And then the atoms will stick together to form a molecule. The atoms will then stick together to form a molecule. For the ionic bonds, we got to see that they are made up of ions, a cation and then an anion. In covalent compounds, no ions are present. No ions are present, unlike in the ionic compounds where they are made up of ions. 